Now deciding to have a bit of a run. Bacchus breaks through, does uh, Lucas Bacchus, and it's just a few meters from the line. Lucas Bacchus gets himself over. There we see the highlights. The big man straight through the middle of the field. Still had plenty of work to do. Fended on the right, spun out of the first tackle, and then reached out to score under the play times. Enrique Lederman steps off the right and then still puts it through the hands. Met with some solid defense. And then ball should have really been shifted. But Raza, now to the left hand side go the school side. Damon coming into the line. Tries yeah, to release Leo Tlela. There we see the replay. Fantastic hands there through the back line. Nice and straight, nice and square. Somebody straightening it up. And then the two on the rig mentioned comes off the head. The rig mentioned comes off the head. Back of should be a routine kick for this young man. It should be. I'm not saying it is. No comment. Head down, follow through. Giddy turns and picks up. The ball comes out to Giddy once again. Pops it onto the boot. Alfonso Isaacs is underneath it. Makes the clean catch and now goes on a run. Does the number 14. Breaks through one tackle. Nice little offload to Damon. Through the heart now goes the SA school side. Mahash is in support. Does get it, but... Uh... There we see nice counter-attack. Pin his ears back straight away from Alfonso Isaacs. And then still has the presence of mind to offload in the tackle to Michael Damon. Who carries strongly. Plenty of offloads. As he tries to jink his way past the defenders. The steal is good. So Brain is now on the left-hand side. Pops the ball onto his boot. And now a foot race between Brainers and Isaacs. Isaacs spools it. Antonio Brainers is right there. Collects the loose ball. Fantastic, just little flick. Then little chip over the top there from Antonio Brainers. We thought we had it covered from Alfonso Isaacs, but the bounce of a rugby ball can never be underestimated. He juggled, taps it back into the... Taps it back into the... Into the midfield. Short little pass for Joshua Bull. And when Bull goes... 8-9 up the blind potentially, and then just a very basic... 9 12 presented for now gives it to Van Heerden once again on the short ball to Porthen. Big unit is Zachary Porthen makes a few meters and now on the wrap, keeping it among the forwards through the hands. And Sibaba Webahashe, the big man Zachary Porthen carries strong. And then the pot's coming around the corner, so effective, just passing before contact to put Mahashe away at the back by uh, Damon, who's uh. Seem to have lost or at least taken off the uh, head protection, but good little interception from the SA school side. Hands it off to Brainers and a big pass over the top, but intercepts it well by Brainers, who then offloads in the tackle. Sorry, the offload get goes to Brainers. It's from Jamil de Jong, it seems. Two brains. Uh, ball on the short ball to Dreya. Makes a few meters, does Dreya besides. Uh, Besides being tackled around the yeah, legs, as once again, now full of running. Oh, the SA school side going for the line is Jack Watts. This is something they would have trained in the week. Thomas Dreyer carries nice and strong. And then quick ball. Some decoy runners. Does the show and go fends with the right and then reaches out as nice just pick and go from Swart. Just two meters to go. Again, Waterhouse. Looking for the try line as Abrams now goes on a little snipe. Does the replacement scrum off? And the closer they edge themselves to the line with that carry from Swart and uh, and Waterhouse. Waterhouse probably thought, yeah, I'm going to get my second one here. But that close to the line, it's nice to see the scrum off. Just settle things down a little bit. They know they're in the ascendancy. Hey, man, I want to take it quickly. It's these as Dreyer takes the taps and go. Thomas Dreyer, you're not going to stop that big man. Austin sets up one rack. And then it's the big boys, of course. Dyer at the front of that who picks and drives and scores. The A side goes to ground. About six meters to go for them. Pick and drive around the fringes. This is good now from the A side. Can they keep the continuity going? Gerba, he has a bit of a pick and go as he's got some support to help him drive himself forward. The balls, there we see it. Sets up one, sets up another, then gets support from his teammates. And he's driven over there with the support of Willem Lopesher. He reaches out for entering that more from the side. It's a tap and go taken quickly. 
very, very quickly by uh, Ruan Swart, it looks like. You see a couple of them turning their backs. The quick tap from the big man, Ruan.